And yes, the FedEx Cup is the season-ending tour event of the PGA Championship. All the majors have been won. The Ryder Cup is in a month's time. But four events to round off the season on the PGA Championship. And there's big money involved. Each of the four events have a $9 million prize pot. There is a winner's share of $1.5 million. Now, that's won some of the biggest amounts of money available on the, Euro on the uh, PGA Tour throughout the year. The format of the event, well, it starts with the Northern Trust. There's four events, 125 players whittled down to 100, then 70, and then 30 for the season-ending Tour Championship. Now, there's extra attention on this year's uh, event because Tiger Woods is involved for the first time in about five years. He is fit and healthy again, and the FedEx Cup has been pretty good to him in the past. This is just a look at how his fortunes have fared in the FedEx Cup just on bonuses alone. So forget about the tournament wins. This is He's $25 million up just on bonuses. That's just finishing top of the point standings. Nearly $10 million more than his next nearest rival. Tiger Woods is back in form after doing very, very well at the, uh, the Open Championship where he finished tied for sixth. He was then a second place at the US PGA Championship as well. So going very well. Now this is going to be a big test though for him. Four tournaments over the course of four weeks and then potentially the Ryder Cup, which he still could be a captain's pick for after that. He knows it's going to be a big test because of that fused spine that he's had to have put together after four back surgeries. He's had a lot of uh, good feeling towards him because of the fans, but that test that he's got coming up, well, he's relishing, as you'd expect he would be. Yeah, I guess and everyone knows that I've, I've struggled and I've had some back pain. I've gone through four surgeries and I'm trying to work, work my way back. And it's been tough and uh, people understand that. How would you characterize the difference? Just to, I mean, it looked like they were more, more wrapped up in the excitement. Not of what just you're last doing week, as I said, not just last week. Yeah, yeah, no. I mean, but I'm just, I think that people are more, I guess, appreciative of it. Um, I don't want to make that sound wrong or anything, but uh, they know that I'm, I'm at the tail end of, of my career, and I don't, I don't know how many more years I have left. Um, but I'm certainly not like I was when I was 22. Everyone very excited to see how Tiger Woods will get on in the FedEx Cup, starting with the Northern Trust. Here he is down in 20th position in the standings at the moment. Dustin Johnson, the world number one, leads the way. And should he stay there, that's $10 million will go in his bank account. Uh, they didn't change the rules the way that the, the money gets distributed because of Tiger's success in the first couple of years of the tournament. It used to all go into retirement fund, but when Tiger looked like he was on for about a billion dollars in his retirement fund, it now comes in more manageable instalments. Rory McIlroy not playing in this week's Northern Trust. One eye on the Ryder Cup. He's gone away to think about his game. Uh, Ricky Fowler and Henrik Stenson also on Ryder Cup watch. They're not going to be available uh, to see this weekend either. But... Um, Tiger Woods is off at around about 1.54 Central European time. Hey everybody, it's Hadley Gamble from our new CNBC Middle East Bureau in Abu Dhabi. Thanks for stopping by. Now to watch more, you can try one of the videos that just popped up on your screen. And don't forget to subscribe.